Looking good, YouTube. My name is Love Game or PD1 Piranha if you prefer, and I am a man destined to be king. In the last episode, we reached Jubilife City, the chillest place on the planet. And I guess we're gonna check it out in this part. I mean, what more is there to do besides go straight to Route 204, which is what we're obviously doing. I don't know what's on this route, fam. Oh, we got some Badoos. Those are the pre-evolution of uh, Roselia. I'm not gonna get one, but there it is if you want it. Roserade's pretty good. I'm not dissing it at all. It's actually a pretty damn decent grass type. I know Darren used to use one. Anything else of note here? Oh, more Starlies. I mean, I guess that's fairly notable. I wouldn't mind getting a Burmy though, because Motham's pretty, uh, pretty dank. Nah, for real, let's, let's run around here for a bit and see what this guy has to say. You should stick around. What do you want a Pokemon campaign soon? If it's something you get out of the train to school. Yeah. Yeah, this is a good idea to do because you can get yourself some much needed XP. Where is this? Where even did I go? What are you trying to say? Yeah, they're talking about the Poketch, which is this thing. It's kind of our, uh, every one of these games had some kind of new piece of technology that your character would carry around and use and do stuff with. Where is the school? It's not the condominiums. It ain't no condo, like a cat condo. Is that it down there? It looks like a school, vaguely. Yeah, I had frame skip turned on, so the thing was probably trying to slow down. Not really slow down, but trying to go too fast. This guy's talking about the blackboard. You know what? I forgot I even had that, but there you go. This homeboy's like, I don't need two of them. There's an item over there just taunting me. Yeah, Oreberg is our next uh, destination of great justice. We'll be heading there soon enough. Right now, though, I'm gonna sell that because I never use X items. <laughs> Although, we have to fight these two guys, and I already know what they have, so. I guess we go and do it. Do we get us the best way to learn? Can we get a battle with you? Pretty sure they both have Abras. No, they don't. Okay, never mind. I, th I guess that might have been in Diamond and Pearl. I don't know. I didn't. I didn't actually play Diamond and Pearl. I mean, I've played a little bit of them, but I didn't really care for those games as much because uh, they're just downgrades of Platinum when when you look at it. You know, we're not gonna win this damage race. So. We're gonna switch instead. Anyways, like I was saying in the last episode, I would like to get my homeboy Nakuza to help me out with like a new YouTube banner or whatever you call those things that are on top of your channel. And if you want, I will pay you for it. It ain't much, I just want you to kind of help me do some editing here. I'm actually working on some Photoshop stuff myself, getting a little bit better at it, so... I found a lot of cool things to do, a lot of china to steal. I guess... I don't know, let's go ahead and fight. We're, we're incredibly brave. Do one of these people have Abra? So I'm gonna feel kinda stupid if not. No, they both do not. Okay then. I guess that's fine by me. They are, of course, faster than us. We're going to try to actually win a fight with Psyche by herself if she doesn't get critical in this next turn. We'll go ahead and heal them, because we were kind of low on the on the HPs. Let's see here. No, yeah, there we go. Not a whole lot else to say here, really. 
But, uh... Hmm. I don't know, Shinx isn't... Or, well, the Shinx line isn't a particularly great Pokémon competitively, but... We're not playing competitive right now, so it doesn't really matter all that much. I mean, it's, it's, it's interesting because it's a physical-oriented... Oh, shit. <sighs> okay, 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 that's fine. I have one, too. I have a few, actually. I was not expecting that. Stop lengthening the time of my videos, Bidoof. Seems like it did more than last time, but I could just be incredibly delusional. Ah, whatever, I'll take it. But yeah, Gen 4 was kind of where I was the most active. Oh shit, okay. Are we really doing this against a Beedoo because he wants to spam potion just like me? Want to get two more hits in? Can we do this? Lost the run to the RNG. <laughs> well, there you go. Eye for an eye, fam. And I do get a level for that, which is pretty good. Yeah, you know, as if you know me from my, uh, at the very least, my Ruby LP. I don't know about gold, but. You know that I'm a lover of the cat-oriented Pokémon. Did she say anything else? Nah. So I gotta have me a Shinx, cause it's a, it's a kitty. Pyrex furs, or no, 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 it's Pyrex stirs turned into Cavalli furs. The full-length cat when I wave the kitty purrs. I've been listening to that song recently. It's called Mr. Me Too by Clips featuring Pharrell. There's this guy at the, not at work, but at a store I go to, whose name I don't even know, but I talk to him all the time. It's weird. I think his name is Chris. I can't remember. But he always makes, for some reason, he has this verbal tick where he makes this brrrr noise. Next time he does that, I'm just gonna reference that song and I'll be like, yeah. We chill retardo, South Beach Gallardo. Whoops. Uh, something goes brrr like it's Nardo's. Women, if you love me, please let me know. Tie rags around your neck and learn the sets we throw. That's how the song goes. It's a pretty cool song. It's all about people that try to one-up you. That's an... That's a relatable thing. And people like to, you know... Anytime you say you have some kind of accomplishment, someone has to say, Oh yeah, well I did that too, but I got it in... You know, like, like well, if we're talking about Pokemon, it's gonna be like, yeah, I just got a shiny, and then the person's gonna be like, oh, I got a shiny, perfect six IV, full team with um, Pokerus. I don't know, that's fairly rare. But yeah, someone's gonna always try to one up you instead of letting you have your accomplishment. Yeah, we don't need to go there yet. I may need to turn on frame skip. Give me one second, because it seems like it's very slightly slowing down. I don't know if that made a difference or not. Okay, yeah, definitely the music sounds more... I don't know. Here we go, last one. All of the answers are yes. I don't know why you would bother even trying to say no to that. I guess we return to the last uh, clown over here. I think we get to fight some clowns later on, oh, which is pretty interesting. No? Okay. What the F do we do then? Go in here? I know I say I have an extensive history with this uh, company, or this company. I'm trying to read the words and talk at the same time. 
No, I have an extensive history with this game. It doesn't mean I have that extensive knowledge. I mean, fairly extensive, but I forgot some of the early game stuff. I just know about all the... Where the Pokemon show up and the type matchups and what have you. Whom do we talk to here, though? This is just a condominium. Another one. Where does your boy turn these in? These guys are useless. Does he say anything? No. Did you bring a light? It's against the Pokedex company, which you would think. Oh, hey. I don't think I didn't see that. That's another potion. Free of charge. Why would we not want that? I have no idea. What is this? Jubilife TV. Well, fuck it. Let's just go. What's even stopping us from going straight up? And battling some of these hooligans. This bitch just called us weak looking. We are about to show her otherwise. Sarah. That is my mom's name. Well, we got a mirror match here, so let's make the best of it, I guess. All right. Now that's how you start one off. That is the good RNG right there. Man, this is just like, this is my lucky day. Like I said, the last time I was LPN was gold, and I was just getting good luck all around. But this, man, let me tell you, Psyche is doing it. She's also a lot older than me, and I didn't know that. I would have never known if she didn't, like, put her age online, but... I don't know her exact age, I just know she's, like, several years older despite looking the same age as me. Tyler... Why are we doing Magikarps this early into the game? Might I ask? I have, like, such an urge to use speed up here, and I don't even know how to do that on a DS emulator, but you know what? We're not going to do that. Oh yeah! By the way, when I mentioned in my Zoid's Legacy LP that I had... that I was sore from working out, it wasn't just that. I actually pulled a muscle, so yay for me! I don't know what that... I think I pulled, like, my lower pec, because that's where it hurts the most right now. Like, for her, I, I can't even... It really fucking hurts when I sneeze. Right now. And I think I made it even worse because I had to open up the garage door earlier today. So yeah, it's just not good. And as such, I've been trying to eat a little bit less since I haven't been able to work out as much due to this in the last, like, two and a half days. Luckily, I had a good backlog of uh, salad in there. Had me a uh, Caesar salad. And chop salad as well, so not a bad thing to eat. Hey, Samantha, that's my girlfriend's name. What the fuck? We got one person named Sarah and one person named Samantha on the same route. Hopefully, she'll get to guest in some of my LPs as well when that time comes. And so do I. Oh shit. Of course, I have to boast about my good RNG, and then this happens. I'm gonna have to heal here in a second. Uh, I'll do one more, and then I'll heal. Hopefully, they won't do a full seven damage. That would just be a bad way to stay in shape. Okay, good. You know what, I could risk it, but I do not want to get a low damage roll and end up embarrassing myself in front of YouTube. I don't have that many subs yet. You know what, I believe in the me that believes in myself. But hopefully I can get some mo. I used to have like 600, but then all that, um, that purge of YouTube happened where they had to like remove all the old accounts. 
And it wasn't even just dead accounts either, it was also accounts that weren't connecting to Google. That was a long time ago though, so I don't know the exact details, but it wasn't cool. Anyways, just getting some levels here, you know how it is. We got charge, which will be useful once we get an actual electric move, but good to have. Anyways, what well, we got here? Yeah. Ravaged path. Which means we can't go this way yet. Anyways, I guess that was a good uh, experience, no pun intended. So we'll head back and uh, do what we need to do. What do you have to say, looker? You said to talk to you later, so let's do it. What? Who do I give the coupons to, fam? Oh. Pretty obvious. Why did you need the app to count to fucking three? Anyways, now our bottom screen is an LCD green and black watch thing going on. But yeah, it's pretty nice, because you can use it for all sorts of different apps, as the guy mentioned. We'll be getting more of those later that you probably won't see unless I can find out some kind of way to do picture in picture here. That's part of the reason I don't do face cam, number one, because I don't really like it all that much. No offense to people that use it, I just don't care for it myself. But, number two, I do not really know how to do picture in picture all that well. Anyways, I guess we should go ahead and leave now that Looker's gone. Are we already fighting this guy again? This homeboy is telling me he got tougher? To that I say, prove it. Chicken. Yeah, just like uh, pretty much all the, what do you call it? All the rivals, he gets the generic flying type of the game and we got ourselves a kitty cat here. I'm just hoping I get this kind of look for the rest of the game, you know? I found Shinx on the first uh, encounter, and then I found I got that critical hit earlier. I'm just doing it to it. Oh, come on. And here, as soon as I say that, here I go with that uh, miss. Wouldn't mind another crit, though. But yeah, the Shinx line is one of my favorite um, designs in all this whole region. That's like the one thing I find this kind of, this region is a bit mixed, I guess you could say. There's some designs I like and some that I don't. I just think the general environment, atmosphere, and the music is all really good, but... The designs are 50-50. There, there's some, it has a lot of my favorites and a lot of my least favorites, too, so take of that what you will. Can we finish this off, or are we going to die to a crit? Let's find out. Okay. I will sure take that. And that should be enough for a level. Yes, it is. I guess we'll bring out Tort for this next fight, because... I'll, I'll do a keep battling so I can get the... XPs for both Pokémon. Hopefully he doesn't have a fire move yet. If not, I do not know what I'm going to do. I'm just going to do a Leer for now, I guess that's not too bad. Fairly certain we're going to get it outsped here, but you know what? I live on the edge every day. Just like my homeboy Shadow. But yeah, how, how could you not like this, man? This is some dank battle music, and we, are, we have a severely lowered defense. I hope we don't die in one hit from whatever hits us when we do finally get hit. I believe that was something that was introduced this generation as well, where the, the, the dudes would, like, talk, say something during the battle. It adds kind of some atmosphere to it, I guess. Alright. Are we gonna die in one hit or not? Okay, we got half health. Shit. I have no idea what to do here because 
we could get potentially stuck in a loop of sorts. Although, Shinx's defense is not lowered, so I think we can just probably switch out. Let's see here. Yeah, we're gonna switch out for safety purposes. So long as our defense isn't lowered, we should be okay as long as we didn't get a crit. There we go. You know what? I th I have confidence I can finish them off, so there you go. Both both Pokemon get XP. There's my useless critical of the day. Always gotta have plenty of those. There you go, Tort, nice and catching up, getting Absorb, our first grass move. Not a particularly good move, but you know, it's it's a something for starts. For starters, I guess. What do you mean I lost? Well, that's it. That's the last time I'll ever lose. I'm gonna become the world's toughest trainer, and you know it. The first trainer I want to do is take on the Orberg City Pokemon Gym. I want to be tough enough for that. Totally. I like your attitude, fam. But that is gonna be it for this part. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And next time we're gonna head on to this uh, Route 203. Have a safe and wonderful day.